So problem number 25 of section 1.3.4 asks us to use the intermediate value theorem to show the existence of a solution to the equation x to the 6 plus 5x cubed equals 1 on the interval 0 to 1. Now recall that the intermediate value theorem says that given any two function, given a continuous function on an interval and take any two points in that interval that and look at their output values, then the intermediate value theorem says that the function has to hit all the values between those two points. So, for example, in this problem here, um, the function f is going to have to hit all values between, zero, between f of 0 and f of 1. And we can use this to show the existence of a solution here without actually even finding the solution itself. So, what we, know, we know that if we let, say, f of x equal x to the sixth plus 5x cubed, then f is going to have to take on all values between f of 0 and f of 1. So we look at f of 0, that's, well, 0. And f of 1 is equal to 1 plus 5, or 6. So we know also have 0 is less than, don't even need the equal sign there, 0 is less than 1, less than 6. So we know that there's some value, we'll call it c, such that f of c hits the value, hits the value 1. So by the intermediate value theorem, or just IVT for short, we know that there exists Some number c. Don't know exactly what it is yet, but that's not important. That's what we're asked to just show the existence, not actually find the actual number. Uh, there is some number c such that f of c is equal to 1.